Spain's government party has stopped its subsidies for green energy while unemployment grows above any acceptable level. Is the government actively dismantling important green industrial sectors and destroying even more jobs? Very actively. The, in the, the government's, Spanish government policy in this moment is conditioned for economic financial crisis and for his ideology. They perceive energy only as input for the industrial sector. And in this sense, they are a bit for in favor of combined cycle, in favor of the extend the life of the nuclear power station. But they don't appreciate the capacity of the renewable energy sector to create employment, to create development, or more to create a new uh, model of produce energy more clean. For them, are no values, and they are producing several regulations, discriminatory against. Uh, renewable energy, and they are producing the continued losses of employment in our sector. How can Spain, a country of sun and wind, use renewables as a key industry to overcome the crisis? Okay, uh, renewable energy industry is not the solution for the crisis, but we can support the force of the country to find new economical models. We think the uh, energy renewables industry in the past was a success case. We came from a country that is not uh, very well known in the world for its technology, but in renewables energy we, we are known for that. We have very good companies that are successfully competing in the whole world. And so, but that in this moment we have the problem that the government of today doesn't believe that is in this sector. And we, we lost our internal market, then we lost possibilities to, of growing outside. And we give to our industry, our economy, good image, technological image. We have a strong bid for research and development. We create employment and we can create in the next year, we calculate with a fair regulation, without super scheme, but with a fair regulation, only with net measuring from PV, we calculate we can create more of 20,000 new employments in the next year. Being here at a conference talking about the Energiewende on a European level, where do you see the biggest problems and the biggest innovations or chances for a European Energiewende? We have a challenge. We are in an economical crisis. Now, in the political agenda, only they have only economic cuts, they have only uh, economic uh, reduction of expenditure, and they are forgot the environmental agenda. We need to put again on the table the environmental agenda. If we don't speak about uh, weather change, does not mean that the problem of the weather change is, is, is resolving. And then we need to put it, because the, pro the main problem that we have in this moment for to be competitive in renewable energy is we are in a moment where the we are like the society doesn't want to support more support scheme but at the same time we continue subsidizing the conventional ones because we are not internalized the external cost of these energies we need to put that on the table in this moment if we want to continue in the path that we wanted at this respect germany can have a leadership. Germany is doing a, a role in this moment of the leadership in the European Union, must play the same role in the world of renewable energy. We need a energy for common policy. And Germany must play the role to lead this new energy policy in favor of renewable energies, in favor of to build up a world more, more clean and at the same time more competitive.